China's first home-built aircraft carrier completes maiden sea trial. China's first indigenously built aircraft carrier today successfully completed its maiden sea trial and returned to its home port in Dalian, a major step in the country's quest to modernize its military and bolster its naval presence in the disputed South China Sea and in the Indian Ocean. China currently has two aircraft carriers. The first aircraft carrier named Liaoning, which was launched in 2012, was a refit of the former Soviet vessel bought from Ukraine. The People's Liberation Army Navy said that the aircraft carrier, built at the Dalian shipbuilding industry, underwent a five-day sea trial starting from May 13. Its sea trial tested multiple facilities and attained the anticipated objectives, state-run China Daily reported. The completely homegrown aircraft carrier, named Type 001A for now, weighs 50,000 metric tons. Earlier, the Chinese Navy said the sea trial aimed to demonstrate the reliability and capability of the ship's propulsion systems. Though Liaoning became operational in 2012, it is being mostly used for research and improvements for the new aircraft carriers China plans to build. China is already building its third aircraft carrier in Shanghai. According to reports, plans are afoot to build a nuclear aircraft carrier. China reportedly plans to have four aircraft carriers by 2030 to operate from the disputed South China Sea as well as the Indian Ocean. The aircraft carriers are being built at feverish pace by China as it enhanced the role of its navy to increase its global influence. With the advent of carriers, China's power projection is expected grow in the disputed South China Sea and India's backyard in the Indian Ocean.